Hi, welcome to another lab note session. In this session, we are going to discuss twice NAT on ASA. Here is our NAT topology with six routers, one ASA and two switches. We have security zones defined outside with a zero security level, DMZ and WAN zone with security level of 50, inside with security level of 100. We have our one place that service provider level, R2, R3, R4, R5, R6 are behind firewall and in this session we'll be checking twice NAT so basically when a source is trying to reach a destination uh, the real destination address will be mapped and uh, once the traffic leaves from ASA uh, the source address also will be NAT. So basically destination and source having address translation. So in our scenario, R2 will be the source and R1's loopback address will be the destination. So this is the same initial configuration I have from the previous lab. show IP route, show IP interface brief, only a default route towards ASA. I'll show you what is happening on R1 also. Just interface IP address, that's it. And on ASA, set now to do twice NAT we need to have objects created for real and mapped IP addresses for source and destination so let's create that object network first we'll create for source real IP 2.1 is the real IP of R2 mapped IP for R2 which is 4 R1 slow back 0 host and map IP 4 R1 slow back 0 which is going to be 1.1.1.88 1 .1 .1 .1 student object these are the four objects we have created right now let's configure the NAT statement the source is in DMZ and it is going to outside then source static here we need to call the real source which is r2's real ip address then mapped ip address of r2 then destination then it's static we need to here we need to call the map type IP address of destination 
this is the mapped IP address of R1 slew back then we'll call the real IP address of R1 slew back that's it sure on that sure on object this is the configuration let's go to R2 and try to ping one dot one dot one dot eighty eight yep we are able to reach R2 show x late we can find net entries are created when R2 is trying to reach one dot one dot one dot eighty eight and did the translation to one dot one dot one dot triple two and on outside when it went to one dot one dot one dot eighty eight it translated to eight dot eight dot eight dot eight. So basically it's telling that NAT from DMZ to outside this is the NAT happened and similarly from outside to DMZ this is the translation happen show NAT so this is in the section 1 since it's a manual NAT now let's verify from r1 also yeah we are seeing reply sent from this source to this destination so basically r1 is seeing r2 as 1.1.1.222 so this is how we can configure twice net i hope you have understood our lab and I would like to thank you for watching.